hi guys hi guys hi guys welcome 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 to my channel for those who have been been here welcome back guys i hope you have subscribed i really appreciate you in this channel and if you are new here please click the red subscribe button and join us we welcome you we really appreciate you in this household today we're going to do as you know for those who don't know in this channel we're helping each other with home rituals home remedies spells that you can perform to completely change your life just come to this channel search whatever program you have the video will pop you just follow the instruction in that video your problem will be solved in few days if you do as we have instructed you in the video you guys so today we're going to do let me leave the holy ashes alone for now we're going to use pure water this is dj clear water you guys what we're going to do you're going to take if this is going to work for both men and women i don't discriminate men i also accommodate them this will work for both genders you take this clear water from the tap you use you wash your private parts with only water you can first wash your whole body with everything then whatever products that you're using and then after that you're only going to wash your private parts with clear water only and then you take that very same water that you have washed your privates you wash your face with that water then you don't wipe it this will happen for those who want to strengthen their relationship for those who want to get married for those who want their partners to be madly in love for those who want their partners to look only at them and to never look anywhere or to anyone else outside so when you done wash your face with the water that you have washed your private you don't wipe it out just wait for it to dry on its own and then when you are done you can take holy ashes not too much maybe just a little bit holy ashes apply it you put it in your hands you rub your hands together then you apply it on your face not too much don't leave yourself having white stuff on your face you don't apply any face cream you don't apply anything just after you wash your face you take holy ashes just half a teaspoon you apply it on your face then you go to meet your partner him or her is going to be madly in love with you him or her is going to be doing whatever you want them to do it's going to listen to you wherever you are is going to come for you whatever you do he's going to be there for you don't forget when you are a woman you don't perform this when you are on your period and when you are a guy or anyone you don't do this when you were with your partner if you do that when you are on a period and when you are with your partner this will never work for you at all this will never work for you you will come and complain and think as if these rituals are not working whereas they are working for others you take your pure water from the tap after you have washed your body and face with everything you take this water you go to your bathroom it must be clean from the tap you go to your bathroom you wash your privates after you have washed your privates you wash your face with the very same water then when you are done washing your face you don't wipe it you let it dry on its own you don't take any cloth to wipe it up you let it dry on its own then when it's dry you take a uh, half the spoon of holy ashes you just puff yourself with a half the spoon of holy ashes 
and then you're good to go <clears throat> mind you you don't have to just wake up wash your privates without washing first you first wash it doesn't matter you guys you first wash with water and soap normally as you wash your body every day whatever products that you are using you first use them and then when you are done you take the pure water you wash only your privates and then when you're done washing your privates you wash your face when you wash your face don't forget you face the sunrise direction we already know for those who have been been here for those who are still new here when we open when we fix we face the sunrise direction when we revenge when we fight it's whereby we face the sunset direction so here we're not fighting we're not revenging we are fixing the relationship or the marriage that's why we are facing the sun rise direction when you after that after applying holy ashes on your face you can go and meet your partner they're going to smile they're going to be happy they're going to listen to you it's not going to happen for that moment only it will be the thing that is going to happen every now and then. don't forget if you are a woman you don't perform this when you are on your period at all you wait for seven days after a period is whereby you can start performing the rituals if you are a man don't forget you don't touch the rituals if you were busy with your partner if you were busy with your partner you don't touch the rituals so that the rituals can work for you so that you don't come here and complain when you see people giving testimony those who have followed instructions giving testimony and when i don't you didn't follow the instruction your rituals did not go as you have planned then you are going to be surprised when you see other people are giving testimony you guys you need to have faith belief and trust and hope that the whatever ritual that you are performing is going to work for you and another thing you need to believe in god Prayer is always the key, you guys. Don't focus on doing rituals and not pray. I myself, I am always praying. I just finished now with my prayer. It's now 5.30 in the morning. Before I start recording, I start with prayers and everything. So guys, normalize praying. Normalize praying. Prayer is the key for every door. It's the master key for every door. So please don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel i really appreciate you here please check if you have subscribed if you didn't subscribe please click the red subscribe button let me love and leave you here bye guys